Hi guys, welcome to another Oh my god, Ark! Look at you look at you! You are here like lickety split. Oh my gosh, two shakes of dragon's tail. Uh yeah, well, yeah, good to see that you were able to make it. He is the first one here. And he's also my uh little bit leader. Yay! Uh oh! So I added some things to uh I added some things to the stream because I got super into um, I got super into like how the how everything's been going. So I added some really cool little uh, overlays and stuff. Uh, kind of like like you can see I don't know what does that even what does that even say right there. Sub 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 Eric Nosy, can you see that? I don't know that looks that looks weird. But anyway, it's going to say, oh, Dave on Ravni joins the show. How's it going? Yeah, so, oh, you know what? I can e make it even even more fancier. So I don't remember where I put it. But once we start the game, wait, is it when we start the game? I'm going to have, like, a little jar and, um, that, like, if somebody follows or subs or whatever, then uh, they can see a little tip jar being filled and little stars dance around and, like, ping around and stuff. Okay, I'm going to turn my mic up because apparently it's too low. Hello, check, 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 check. I'm using Streamlabs OBS now, so uh, this took hours to set up last night. I cannot turn this up any louder. So anyway, again, first 10 minutes, we're going to just hang out and let people join. Um, last str last stream when I downloaded the video from Twitch and then I uploaded it to YouTube, I listened to it and it just sounded like my voice was too quiet in some areas. So hang out for a couple minutes while I mess around with a couple of settings and we'll start in 10 minutes. Okay, I boosted it just a little bit more, so it should be, I mean, like, you can, I know you can hear me pretty clearly right now, but I had to turn the game volume up so that you could hear the, uh, the voice actors better. <clears throat> so also, I'm finishing off a couple tacos, gotta refuel. Oh, you can probably hear me.
So how was everyone's day today? There's going to be some better transitions too. I actually made um actually made scenes for switching around to uh oh and how do you like my be right back when I take a break? Ta da! Super cute. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There's the little there's a little jar too. So like if anybody and like if somebody follows or if somebody um Sin! How's it going, buddy? Welcome to the chat. Hey, cool transition st stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that's going to be for Be Right Back, and then this is starting soon, and then if I just want to have you on my desktop, then I can just have you on my desktop. This took a few hours to set up last night, but I was super excited. Also, I wanted to just like ask you guys if it's okay to have the, the chat in the lower left. If you feel more, do you feel kind of uncomfortable having it like actually on the screen? Would you rather me, um, would you rather me remove it? Seven minutes left. We have three-ish minutes to go. Let's make sure that I have the appropriate amount of water. I do not! I'm out of water. Either way is fine for sin. Ark, you okay with that? Oh, the top left where it has like the Rosa Ergnosi stuff and stuff, it's supposed to just display like if people follow, if people subscribe, if people donate or whatever. <clears throat> but that's all fake. I don't know why it's there. I think it's because I was like testing it earlier. Ark, uh, I was I was wondering if you feel okay, or if every everybody in chat, if anybody has any, uh, what do you call it, like disagreements with having the chat being shown on the sc on the sc on the screen on the stream, right? So if you look at the stream, it's the bottom left. You can it's now showing the chat, and so when I download it and I upload it to YouTube, the chat will be visible, right? Who we got in here so far? Let's take a look. Oh, that's perfectly fine. It's all good. Okay, I just didn't want to feel like I was invading your privacy if, like, you wanted to have more of an intimate atmosphere in the chat, uh, right? Okay. How many minutes? Dose minutes? Dose minutes to go before we start downfall? Oh my God, I'm so excited for where we left off. I hope everybody was able to catch up. I meant to stream much earlier in the day. Aw, Ark. <laughs> Ark says, I appreciate you. Um, what was I saying? Burp. A -d 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 really excited about where we left off. We're in a coffin. Oh, I am dying with curiosity to find out if there was any way to avoid being killed by the axe murderer. Really super tempted to look it up, but I don't want to... You're right! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time out. Time out. That's a great, that's a great idea, Dave on Refni. Thank you. You're right. It is starting to get kind of long. I was expecting it to... All right. Let's see if we can do this on the fly. Possibly. Let's just just uh, stand by, stand by. Boop boop a doop a doop a doo doop. Boop boop a doop a doop a doo doop. Chat box. Let's lower it. No. Oh, it's gonna. <sighs> Let's see height. Height. I'm gonna make you like half. I'm gonna make you like half as tall. And you're gonna be down there. It's still well, not right at the edge, but. Okay, let me see if this is reflected now. Oh, it cleared the chat. Okay. I think, okay, I think chat will be great, but it might. How do I expand my chat? Can I make it a pop out? I can make it a pop out! Also, it's showing on Streamlabs. Ugh, jeez. What a noob. Okay. I have a lot going on on my screen right now. I'm not digging it.
Ten minutes, it's been ten minutes! No, I don't want any not safe for work. I, I won't put any... I didn't put any, like, uh, blocks on the... What? Is it... Has anybody spoken? Alrighty, 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 alrighty. Why is it showing me this? Ahem, excuse me, moderator. Why is it showing me this? Like on my on my live screen, it's showing me this. I want to see my stream. Down here? Can I put it up here? Oh, I see that, I see that. Okay, okie dokie, just making my life a little easier. Thank you for being so patient. Or skipping ahead so that you don't use some of your patience now and save it for when I'm stuck on a clearly obvious puzzle. Uh, let's see if you appeared on the chat now. Did you appear in the chat? Is that better, Davon Refni? <clears throat> well, I guess you can't tell now because it's not full up. Peekaboo! Well, uh, since as well, I suppose bloody murder isn't safe for work, but if history is any indicator, murder is fine. It's nudity that must be censored. I don't... Wait. I don't think there's any explicit nudity? Oh, no, no, no. Uh, I meant in the chat. I meant, like, I'm not going to put any restrictions for, like, not... I don't know. I hope I don't get in trouble for streaming that part with all the like the larger women in the bathroom. <clears throat> all right, I need an injection of caffeine. Where I don't have any more energy drinks. All my bangs are just gone. I had them on auto delivery. They're supposed to deliver me an entire case of Bangster Berry Berry Bang. But. Ow! Oh, the pain. Guys, do you ever hate it when, like, you take a big chug of, like, a freshly opened soda? Ah, oh, and, like, the carbonation starts expanding inside your esophagus as it's going down your chest, and it feels like somebody's ripping your chest open from the inside? Ah. Oh. Okay. So far, everyone has been dressed on screen. Well, Sin, don't forget about the, um, don't forget about the ladies in the bathroom. The one with the, the second Sophie remnant, or whatever we're calling her. Time out, time out, time out, time out. How do I add a time out? Let's do that before we start. Sorry, I said 10 minutes. I lied. I lie a lot. Not intentionally. I mean, it just turns out to be a lie. Like, like I say we're going to start in 10 minutes, but then I'm like, oh shit, I, st I need to make like, adjustments to this. I need to make adjustments to that. Take a look at this cute little, oh my gosh, this cute little jar. I love it. Oh, it's being filled with things. Too cute. Okay, goodbye. <clears throat> oh shit, I'm going to have to change that for every scene now. Uh, oh, oh. All right, stand by again. It's some of this I just can't do when the stream is not live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bits were yeah, bits were strategically covered by like shadow or blood or just undefined in the artistry. Uh, okay, so chat box, we made that smaller. Do, 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 do. Chat box. Move you down. Move you down, Mr. Chatbox. And how in the world do I add a timeout? I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put it on the game. Cause I can mess with the rest of it later. The only thing that matters right now is the game. Timeout, 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 timeout. Chatter. Timeout. I don't see any options for timeout. Font size. Font 
I'm sure it's I'm sure it's possible. Oh, hide message after 15 messages. Um <clears throat> Well, you know what? Since I made it smaller, since I made it smaller, it's not going to exceed that length. So, but I do want it to time out actually. Um I did find that. All these cool new things! <coughs> Where was it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I can't put a timer for it to time out, but... Hide messages after... I don't know, like 10, maybe? Meh? Oh no, don't always show messages. Okay! Yes. Let's leave it like something like that. Okay, so it should like go away. It should fade out like at about 18 seconds, <clears throat> but only during the game. I'll I'll change the other settings later. This is more important. Alright, who do we got here? We got Apricot, Droop Fruit, Arcavius, the Botifitus Commander Root, Davon Raphne Sin is here, Slow Cool, and Vane Kyber is here. Okay, we're gonna get underway in just a second. Hold tight, hold tight. Nope, 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 nope. Shut it. I want my dashboard up though. <clears throat> All right, let's do this. I'm going to set this for downfall right now. Good God, I want that list to go away. Oh, I want to clear it. I really want to clear that list in the top left. Don't know how. Okay, I'll work on it later. Um, Downfall. Let me know if the uh, game sound is too loud. Shit, 18 minutes in! Ah, oh, I'm so terrible. I'm awful. I'm the worst. Okay, we're gonna skip... We're gonna try to get rid of that. Yay! Okay, didn't crash the game, thankfully. Press escape. All right, how does that how does that sound? Does that sound super super loud? <gasps> Here we are. Okay. Oh my gosh, good. I get it. All right. So, we just got slaughtered. But then again, there were there were scenes where like Susan got slaughtered too. She like well, of course she did. She couldn't die, right? That was kind of part of the premise. So, never mind me. Uh, but no, like he act. I don't know if we actually died. But we've chosen to proceed as. Joe, not Agnes. Let's take a look at our surroundings. It's a coffin. I'm buried alive in a goddamn coffin! <clears throat> huh. We've got castor oil! Everything else is gone, but we have castor oil. Help! Help! Let me out! Is there anyone there? There's no one out there, Joe. You might as well give up now. <gasps> what? It's easier that way. Okay, hold on, I gotta I do have to tap out, sorry. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, well it's good that it happened early. Game crashed. Sorry. But I did need to alter okay. 
All right, this should be the one. Okay. Uh, Sin says that dude who beat his cam his wife off camera. Dude, I saw that. That was insane. He legit beat it. Well, I, okay. If people want to debate the uh, what? Hello, downfall. Come on, come at it. Come on. People want to debate like the definition of beating your wife when like I don't know maybe hit her once or maybe maybe a couple times you can clearly tell that she was really smacked at least once but that was that was freaking awful um the other one who made his community believe he was wheelchair bound then got up out of it right in the middle of stream they're the worst oh jesus yeah that's pretty shit that's pretty shit they're shit human beings I wish this uh, game was not so touchy All right, we're buried. Gah, gah. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Scrape, let me out of here! Help! <gasps> oh shit, I missed that the first time. Let what the fuck out. is that? <laughs> ah, You're gross. It's easier that way. We're not gonna... We're not gonna give up. You never give up in situations like this. You fight, you bite, and you tear, and you scratch. And you survive! By the way, is the uh, game sound too loud now? Please tell me. Is my voice now too loud? Please tell me. Who are you? It's been so long. I've forgotten their name. It all just doesn't matter when you're dead. Well, we're not dead. All there is left is watching and waiting. Watching and waiting. Watching and waiting. Ah! Is that supposed to be us later? I don't know, maybe. How do you know my name? Am I dead? Clearly we're not dead. Look, I can see the rise and fall of his chest. You know, we're not decaying. Where am I? How do you know my name? Where am I? Where am I? This place has many names. Some call it the void. Some call it the grave. Some call it six feet under. Some call it the tomb. But we like to call it. Wait for it, Joe. The paradise. Ah, oh, what? Flesh. God. <laughs> Jesus. Um, okay, so we're gonna save over F3. And I'll try to turn it up a smidge without crashing the game. Okay. Please don't crash, please don't crash, please don't, please don't crash. Okay, sweet, we're safe. How, How do you know, do my, know name? my name? The maggots told us. They told us all about you. The maggots! Queen maggots. of maggots, guys! That look like people. But you mustn't trust them. Because they're maggots. All they want is to... All that maggots want is... To eat your fucking brain, Joe. Damn. <laughs> Funny fellas, them maggots. Uh, I'm not gonna die like this. There's got to be a way. You're just voices in my head. Go to hell. I'm not gonna die like this. There's got to be a way. Oh, but there is. Look around you. Closely. It seems that someone's left a little gift for our good friend, Joe. Lucky him. Always led a charmed life, this one. <laughs> you call this a charmed life? Oh my god, that's hilarious. Yeah, Joe, living the charmed life. His little brother was completely blown apart in front of his eyes. You know very well what it is, Joe. The only way out of here. The only escape. What is it? Oh, it's gotta be something horrible, right? Are you man enough to do it? Is it to kill do himself? Does he have to- you do what you gotta do? I- Oh shit! And it's all over. No, that's not- this second. doesn't make any sense. Be in charge of your own destiny. You could never have won that battle anyway. It 
was lost from the start. All there's left is to do the right thing and save your face. Not that there'll be much of it left if you do fire that gun. Ha. <laughs> <laughs> Choose a faster way, choose a slower way. <laughs> Holy shit! Damn. Choose a faster way, choose a slower way. I'm so curious. Like, that's not the one I want to choose, but I just have this... This really strong desire... To, uh... Find out what is the slower way. What do you think? Shit. Talk about a Sophie's choice. Yeah, pretty much. It's like, oh, choose to do it or don't choose to do it. And then when you choose not to do it, it says, okay, how do you want to do it? I guess it's best to, uh, yeah, it's best to... Oh! <laughs> That's fucked! I guess we're going the slow way. What, suffocation? Ooh. Agnes. Where is she? That's strange. I have seen no um, rooms that look like this. I really don't know what to say. I died again. That's what you should say. Nah, I don't even know whose room it is. Blanket. Looks warm. Nice door, I guess. <laughs> like, what do you say when you examine a door? She's locked in. in. Who is it? The door's locked, and I don't have a key. So please go away, yeah? <laughs> That's scary. I'm calling the police. Uh, hide under it? Ah! No. Whoever you are, go away. I'm trying to back away. I can't move. Okay. Don't panic, Agnes. We need to. We need to get out of here. Window. Fast. Window. Take bed throw. Sure. Radio. Turn that on. What? What'd that say? It's an oldie, but still better than nothing, I guess. I thought maybe the music could mask what we're really doing. Lovely weather. Open. Examine. Poor Mo Mr. Moose. Let's talk to Mr. Moose. Don't worry, Mr. Moose. Everything's gonna be just fine. I'll find a bast- I'll find a bastard that- Chopped your head off and I shall avenge you. You see a lot of stuff going on in this room, don't you? You poor thing. I promise if I ever find your wandering body, I'll send it your way. <laughs> don't worry, Mr. Moose. Everything's gonna be just fine. Yes. Shit, something happened. Take the blanket. Nope, take the blanket. Take the blanket. Okay, and then we're gonna use the bed throw. Right. Okay. Window. Uh no no no. We need to throw we need to throw the blanket so that we don't hurt ourselves maybe? I don't know. Hmm, nope. Okay. Maybe we just escape. So I Mr. Moose is a pretty chill dude. Yeah, you're right, Sid. Uh close, climb out. A makeshift rope is not long enough. Oh. Okay. You see that. Add more. Add more. Let's get out of here! Did I miss anything? The radio? Anything else? Let's get the fuck out. Climb out. <gasps> they used the lock! Oh shit! Nice weather. Well, I think she was being sarcastic. Ow. 
Good thing you have a nice fluffy wedding dress, I guess. <clears throat> now what? Auto saving. Thank you for auto saving, because I forgot. Quiet Haven Hotel. What am I doing here? Wait, let's look at what's on the other side first. I could probably climb over it if I wasn't wearing this stupid wedding dress. It's locked. Yeah. Car! Someone parked in the middle of the lawn. Not cool. This could be my ticket out of here. Problem is, I can't drive. I'm sure you could if you tried hard enough. Whoops. Jesus. No, we're gonna try anyway. The door. But the door isn't there any anymore. <laughs> well then why was the command? This car, if it if it starts, I'm going to be so shocked. Oh, of course it is. Hmm. Yes. Who you think leaves the charmed life now? She can break through the fence. Yeah. Genius. I have to go back in where the killer is. Yeah, maybe we have to go back and help Joe. Or. Okay. Nothing on this side. Something heavy to put... What do I have on my on, on me? Do I have anything in my inventory? Doesn't look like it. So, where does this, this gate goes out of here? I guess? Statue. A fake Roman god gazes upon the, hel the hotel's garden. Let's give it a little push. This is called artistic modification, guys. Feel free to do it anywhere. Take the head, take the leg, take... The oh my god! <laughs> Jesus. Well, she said something heavy, so obviously it's not the last one. Can I put the door? Put, can you put the door on the pedal? Oh yeah! Well, probably not. I mean, I don't see how it could, like... You'd have to get it in at the right angle and then have it reach down to the, like, floor of the car. Da 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 Examine. Don't look so upset. I'm just taking you for a walk. On a drive. And a drive. Okay. Like surely surely you would have at least the very, very, very basic uh not that way, you stupid car. Oh my goodness, it was in reverse. Blah. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, it's uh, since it's, it's interesting how she anthropomorphizes things. That's funny. Is it on fire now? Shit. Hopefully the rain will put out the fire. You know what I didn't do? I didn't check. I didn't check the gate. The other gate. Oh, I can't go back. Okay, well, the gate was probably locked. The other gate leading into the hotel was probably locked. Spooky, scary forest. This is actually kind of how it is at my house today. Oh, it looks like it's clearing up a little bit. It's raining. This reminds me of the forest that uh, Susan walks back and forth through. I wonder if we're going to have to do the same thing. Walk back and forth and the scenery changes. I don't like this. This looks like a place an axe murderer would show up at. Doll? Sad looking doll. Who left it here? It's hard to imagine a child who would play in a place like this. Sin, are you in Canada? Corridor. Oh goodness, autosave. Hmm. It always puts me on edge when I see Oh jeez, this is a maze. I have not been paying attention. Oh my goodness. Six wait wait wait. That way said six 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 six. Let's continue this way then. Six 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 six. Is this a ma Pumpkin! 
pumpkins! Pumpkin time! What a waste. What a horrible waste of pumpkins. Jeez Louise, you know how many pumpkin pies we could have made about of this? Pumpkin bread. Uh, since says, yep, Calgary, Alberta. Lots of snow. Recently, the winter's been mostly temperate. The Arctic outflow have been troublesome. Hmm. I've always wanted to go to Canada because uh, I always thought it would be really, really beautiful there. Let's smash it and see what's inside. Or maybe form a rock band. Okay. Bleeding pumpkin. Red goo is oozing out of the smashed pumpkin like blood. Well, maybe it is blood then. Maybe you murdered that pumpkin. Okay, I think we need to go. Ah! Oh my god, what the hell? Could <laughs> oh boy. Hey! What kind of a scream was that? I feel like. Like, my vocal cords didn't engage, so it was like a... <laughs> oh, man. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> I'm embarrassed about that laugh. Why is she sitting alone in an empty room? She must be mad. Hello? Who are you? I'm Ivy. Okay. She sounds like a demon. Hi, Ivy. Just I'm saying. Ivy. I'm terrible. So, I probably won't remember it anyway. Just say what you want and leave me be. I'm not looking for company. Uh, why didn't Joe ever have the option to mention that he was looking for his wife? I promise I won't take much of your time. Agnes seems like a nice gr lady. What is this place? Why would it? Uh, well, it does look like a big toilet. Yes, thanks for explaining it. That's exactly what I thought, and that's exactly why we should leave. That's exactly what I thought, and that's exactly why we should leave. It's too late for that. What? Why? It's complicated. I don't really want to talk about it. I'd rather be alone, if you don't mind. Really? She's In giving up. In a place up. like this? It's none of your business. Someone's following me. We need to get out of here. I can't. But it's some crazy mother. He's got an axe. I know. But she will never let me go. Who? Shh. She. Who is she? She is the monster. She might be talking about Sophie. She's a god and a devil. Okay. A a demon. Great. Why don't you just make some room for me on that chair? And we'll wait together for our imminent death, shall we? I don't need your bitter irony. I knew you wouldn't understand. Go away. But how? This place is full of dead ends. I'm lost. There is one way. It leads right through her house. But maybe, maybe you can make it. I will make it, but you're coming with me. Can't help me. There's no way I'm leaving this room. This place is batshit crazy. Stop moping. The sooner we go, the better. I said no. Uh, I can I can see Agnes as like an eternal optimist. Well, if you change your mind, I'll be out there fighting demons. All right, you stay here and drown in your misery. No, I think. Okay, I know earlier at the beginning of the game, I was like, I'll oh, respect her wishes when she says no. But um, I think I think it's probably better that she comes with me. <laughs> I'm looking out for her. Get your ass off this chair right now. And follow me. But no buts. You'll be fine. I will protect you. 
Aww. Is she gonna do it? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, it worked! There's a door in one of these rooms here. You won't open without a handle. You'll need to make one. Make a door handle? Not a real handle. It's just one suited for a door like this. Okay. Cool. I'll deal with that. You just follow me, yeah? It's time to bust out of here. I like her attitude. She's not a defeatist. Like, uh... uh I don't know about going that way. Well, I suppose we should. Careful now. I think the man that follows me went through here earlier. Shit. Okay. I don't know which way he went, though! And I gotta find this door. Wait, did I just turn back around? What was that? That looked like a very weird screen thing. Oh boy. Okay, we need to look for markers. Let's go down here. Okay, so... Alright, this is where we started. Let's go back to the pumpkin room. Pum pumpkin pumpkin! Pum pumpkin pumpkin! What's with the pumpkins? Dinner. Ew. Oh, some of them are covered in maggots. You can tell. You can kind of tell. Okay. I just wanted to see what Ivy would say or have an idea. Six, 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 six. Okay, we're not going to go back that way. Let's try the way we came, the way we started. Wait. What? Is that really... That's it? That's it on this wing of the whatever this is building? Okay, yes, we're going this way whether we like it or not. Okay, so. Go down this corridor. Okay, this is a right. Yeah, yeah. Wait. What? Why? How does that work? How does that work? Oh, is this the corridor we came from? Right there. Yeah, it is. Oh my gosh, the camera stuff is driving me crazy. What the heck? Strange. Very strange. I really like that little red ribbon on Ivy's skirt. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to go down this way. Here. Ooh. That's the door I was telling you about. I'll pretend I believe you for now. No matter how crazy this sounds. Huh. Okay. It's a blood wall. So, what kind of door handle did you have in mind? Isn't it obvious? One. That's suited for a door like this. So, what okay. kind of door handle... Isn't it One. Okay. So skinny. What a terrible role model for little girls. She kind of looks like a brush with that name of, with that mane of thick hair. Okay, 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 okay. I know how to use this then. Let's go back to the pumpkins. We're going to dip the hair into the stuff that looks like blood in the pumpkin. Then we're going to use it to paint a handle on a uh, red handle onto the door. Uh, yes. This way. It should be weird loopy artistry. Yep, it should be 666s. Six, six, sixes. Yep. I'm getting the hang of this. I'm getting the hang of this. Pumpkin, examine. Okay. Uh, boop a doop a doop a doo. Dip, dip, dip. Gross. Now what's it say? Bloody doll. <laughs> Yuck. It's covered with this red stuff. Maybe I could paint something with it. Like a door handle. I'm a genius. This ain't my first adventure game. Wait, nope, nope, keep going. Because, nope, wait, because that way is... Did we ever go this way? I don't think we ever went this way. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Forget that, forget that. I don't care what's in that direction, but I know where I need to go. 
I'm not going to do any extra exploring and possibly run into... Run into, uh... Mr. Axeman! Mr. Happy Axeman! Shit. Really? Yep, here we are. Okay, 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 okay. I thought I lost my bearing for a minute, but I did not. Okay! And we have a perfect door handle. Now, how do we use it? Push it. But this is never going to work. <laughs> oh, there's mir mirrors? No, mouths. Mouths. No, ah! no Ivy. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. Aww. Okay, I'm back. What happened to chat in the video? Oh, it's it just times out after a little bit. Arc. Holy shit, mouths, huh? Mouths, mouths, mouths. Does this have to do with the eating disorder theme? Piss off. Even though you've got like the perfect Cupid's bow, you? Jesus. So this sounds familiar. Guys, is this the same voice that did the Queen of Maggots in uh, Susan? Unlucky victim of lip augmentation gone wrong. <laughs> I could care less. Yeah, let's defend Ivy. You must be the bitch that poor girl was talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Ivy? Oh. Gosh. Well, at least we got her to come with us. Hopefully she'll have a little bit of self-determination. I think this is the voice. It's from Susan. Yeah, it's the same lady. I'm Look at it. Not as scary as they paint me. It even has the vocal distortion. Gosh. Please, be my guest. I want to go back and play the cat lady again. In preparation for Lorelei. Have some soup. Uh, I don't trust anything that you no would thanks. eat. Why? Is there something wrong with my soup? I don't know what it is. Yeah, I figured. Yes. There really, really is. <laughs> it's blood. <laughs> It's tomato. Uh, no, it's not. Liar. Oh, dear girl. Why so rude? Calling me names. Then all I'm trying to do is to be a good host to my unexpected guest. <laughs> I'm not eating blood. Thank you very much. Then. I won't. But I bet your good friend Joe would gobble up every last bit of it. What? Why is that? Is he a vampire? No, he wouldn't. You're crazy. Why is that? Is he a vampire? The worst kind. <gasps> Parasite. Th 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 this is from this is this is from the cat lady, or uh, rather, that from the cat lady is from this. It's calling people vampires and parasites. No, he wouldn't. And you're crazy. I don't blame you. You don't know Joe as well as I do. Yeah? And how do you know him? He's... Uh, a friend of a friend. He came by not long ago. Did you... give him your soup? He only tasted it. But he's already building up quite an appetite for it. I can tell. Oh, is she talking about him killing the first Sophie? I've been warned about you. It was nice chatting about soup, but I think I'll go now. 
Um, who are you? I mean, who are you really? It doesn't matter. She's not going to answer. She's going to be all cryptic. Is she talking about his thirst for blood? In that he killed the... Killed, quote. Unquote. Air, air quotes. Uh, the first Sophie... And she's predicting that he's gonna go ahead and kill all the others, too. Captain, how's it going, dude? Welcome. I'm glad you can make it. So, Captain, I don't know if you have played the Cat Lady or, um, or watched uh, a playthrough of it, but this lady is, uh, appears to be the same Queen of Maggots from... This, this lady is, seems to be the same... Queen of Maggots Lady from the Cat Lady. God, that's a lot of ladies in sentence. And uh, we're just having a little chat with her. I've been warned about you. I met a young girl who said you were a monster. <laughs> <laughs> what, what is with I all these an <laughs> answering and laughs? Not really. Yeah, you do. Can be deceiving. And why are you telling me this? I, I guess I felt sorry for the girl. I think you've done something really horrible to her. That, my dear, is none of your business. But between you and me, the bitch had him coming. What? Who are you? I mean, who are you really? It was nice chatting. I don't think I really care who you are. Um, who are you? I mean, let's do it who anyway. Who are you really? Why? No, I'm just a bitch. Some girl told you about. You said you have many names. I'm just curious which one is real. I've not used my real name for a long time. I don't need names. I am the queen of maggots. Nice. Adored and feared by all. And this is my kingdom of death. She <laughs> nice. Uh cell block tango, right? Right? Little cell block tango reference from Chicago. Ark. He's on it tonight. It was nice, but there was once another name, am I right? Yeah, let's really push it. I'm not afraid of her. Not as Agnes. You know, I it's very strange. If I were playing as Ivy right now, I'd probably be very afraid. But because of the the type of character that I've laid out in my choices, my dialogue choices with Agnes, I just feel how much confidence she has. Is that ridiculous? Is that getting too too into it? I I don't think so. It's it's good. It's very immersive, I think. But chatting with her here as Agnes, I feel Agnes's confidence and is not afraid of her. Um but there was once another name, am I right? Yes, there was. But why would I tell you about it? You don't even belong here. Just passing through. I have no quarrel with you, young lady. I'll eat the soup if you tell me. Fine, keep it. Whatever. Yeah, I don't really care. Fine. Keep it. Whatever. I'm not so gonna eat your soup. Friendly. It was nice chatting about soup, but I think I'll go now. So early? What about the main course? It's been waiting in the oven for a while now. Well, then it must be burnt, and you're a horrible cook, so no thanks. I'm on a strict diet, actually. Goodbye. Some other time. Goodbye. No, just no. Um, so what I think might be happening is that, uh, the Queen of Maggots is kind of tormenting... <gasps> the Queen of Maggots is kind of tormenting Ivy the way that she was tormenting Susan in The Cat Lady. And when did that occur, guys? What was going on in the game when Susan con was confronted by the Queen of Maggots? She attempted suicide. Or possibly completed it, right? Completed it, and then the Queen of Maggots sent her back to, like, have survived it? Yes, when she died. When she attempted suicide. Now think about, like, think about what's going on in Ivy's head and the, the problems that she's been having with, like, really, really poor body image. Um, 
having obviously having bulimia going back to that actually uh, remember when we played as Ivy very briefly in her bathroom and her little demonic voice inside her head was telling her there's one way out there's the only way out you know what it is you've been there before many times and it was the toilet bulimia it was it was the bulimia that's what it was referencing so what if uh, what if what happened to uh, Ivy is she actually did attempt suicide or complete it, who knows, and then uh, confronted the Queen of Maggots and was returned as if she survived it. Like, maybe that's why Joe took her on this holiday to begin with, is to try to help things. But the Queen of Maggots is now basically tormenting her. I mean, Susan had to go through and kill a bunch of the parasites, quote-unquote parasites. But that doesn't seem to be the case. You know, maybe it's unique, to, it's unique to each person, what the Queen of Maggots demands of you, how she torments you. Uh, no. No, you know what? I feel like she'd just be, like, dismissive I'm and humorous. I'm on a strict diet, actually. Goodbye. All food looks just awful. Why would anyone want to even touch this stuff? All food? What, what? All food looks just awful. Why would anyone want to even touch this stuff? Have you changed your mind about the soup? Why would you use a fork on the no. soup? I just wanted to borrow this fork for a minute. If you're not going to eat, leave the cutlery for the next game. Fine. Please. Fine. Screw you. One more thing. What? Yeah? Could you kindly blow out one of the candles in the next room? <gasps> Why? No. Just a little tradition in my house. I ask all my guests to do that. Okay. I'll think about it. Yeah, it's possible. Uh, Ark says... Ark says, is this why the lady is bothering this girl? Because she died and came back? Um, I don't think so, because the Queen of Maggots basically said, you're... you're you don't belong here, like, you're not part of this, and, uh, Agnes is like, I'm just passing through. We're not gonna blow out a candle, and you know why? Whoop, Ark always says, that was what the Queen of Maggots wanted Susan to do. Yeah, I'm not gonna, no, I'm not gonna eat it. Um, blowing out a candle in the Cat Lady blew out someone's life. Holy shit, it's following me! What a monstrosity. And besides, we don't trust her, we've been warned about her, we're not gonna do anything, she's tells us to do. Withered roses, they've been dead for a long time. Oh good, it auto-saved for me. Shit. Okay, so let's save over like, I don't know, F1. In case it auto-saves again and there's only one auto-save. What a lonely seashore. There's something different about this coffin. What coffin? Oh, the oh, there's a wooden one on the floor. It's nailed shut. We need to let Joe out! We need to let Joe out. Shit. If we took the fork... Oh no, it's... It's gonna make me blow out a candle or something. Or it's gonna force me to eat the soup before I can leave. Isn't it? So many candles in a room full of wood. Not safe. Oh, she left. Oh, hey, take the fork. Screw you, lady. Yeah, yeah. We're going to open this coffin now. Nope, nope, nope. We're not blowing out any candles. That was what the Queen of Maggots wanted Susan to do. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, wait, wait. That was what the Queen of Maggots wanted Susan to do? Wait, which one? Yoink, fork acquired. <laughs> I'll need something bigger to pry this op this to pry open this coffin with. What? Why? What the hell? Uh, what about use the fork here? I don't know. What else? Fork on the flowers. Fork the flowers. Fork. Fork on the candles. Nope. Damn it. On the candle. 
Or I mean on the painting? Nope. Well, I have the... Yes. Yeah, yeah, Ark. The, about, about the candles. Yeah, that's kind of what I was referring to. I'm pretty sure I can see a hidden compartment underneath. Like, how would she notice that? And this is why you always put a rug over loose floorboards. Amateurs. <laughs> I can't quite fit my fingers in the gap. I need to pry it with something. Alright. Let's use this. There we go. Add a girl. Cow... Cow bar. Cow bar! Okay, uh, crowbar, how lovely. And here's me messing up a perfectly good fork. Why would you have a fork? Why? Why did I just get the impression that... Hmm, some of the paintings changed. changed. They didn't. Yeah, we're not, we're not blowing out your feckin' candle. Alright, let's let Joe out. Hopefully Joe's in here. I mean... <laughs> That sounds like a really weird thing to say. I hope my friend is nailed inside this coffin that's not making any noise. Right, let's do this. But I hope he is, because he's not dead. It is Calbar now. It is him! Joe! It's you! Nice. What were you even doing in there? Oh, I guess the axe man put me in there. I was just about to shoot myself in the head. I, I really believed I'd, be, I'd been buried six feet under. Huh. I, Let's be a little vulnerable. I really believed I'd been buried six feet underground. If that was the case, I guess I... I would have found a shovel and dug you out. <laughs> how did you... How did you find me? I guess it was destiny. Where are we? Yeah, not a nice place. We should probably start looking for a way out. Yeah, follow me. And what? Follow you? Thanks. Yeah, that seems like incredibly traumatizing, right? Why are there cur... Oh, that must be a window. I was going to say, why are there curtains over a wall? Agnes is a real heroine, just willing to do whatever the, whatever for the sake of others. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Hey, Joe? Why am I here? I mean, what is my purpose in all this? I have absolutely no idea, to be honest. The doctor said you were important, but he didn't really explain why. You're here to help me save my wife, aren't you? Hmm... The doctor said you were important, but he didn't really explain why. Important? I like the sound of that. <laughs> Bear in mind that the doctor seemed crazy as a loon. Now, don't be jealous, Joe. <laughs> Just because I'm more important than you. Yeah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> but can we please go now? I don't want to see another coffin for the rest of my life. Yeah, that'd be super traumatizing. What does he think? Oh, okay. He thinks the exact he thinks the exact same thoughts as Agnes. This Makes sense. Be Weird. Four eleven. Quite sure looks like it. Maintenance. Maybe this would be a good time to explain what's going on. Management office. Ha! Holy mother. Six 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 six. I'm gonna cut this short. No, let's explain the whole thing. Let's start from the very beginning. Yay, story time! It's not really the kind of story you'd like to hear. I expected that much, but let's hear it anyway. Uh, we've been going through a rough patch with my wife. My wife, Ivy, has this illness. Ah. Uh, Shoot, how should I phrase this? Mm. We've been going through a rough patch with my wife, arguing pretty much every day. I don't know what's gotten into her, but... The Queen of Maggots! place online. Quiet Haven Hotel. So, I thought, why not go away for a weekend? Just me and Ivy. Maybe it 
wasn't too late to fix it. <laughs> but I messed up again. I should have been a better husband. What did you do? I'm not even sure. She didn't want to talk to me at first. And when we finally got to our room, Say she was gone. Gone home? No. Taken away. Kidnapped. I know this sounds absolutely fucking crazy, but it was a monster. It was a woman called Sophie. It's something that lives in the mirrors. Um, it was a monster. It was a woman called Sophie. It's something that lives in the mirrors. All we know is it's a monster, really. That's what we were told by the by the hotel lady. Have you seen it? Oh shit. It's hidden away for now. Where? Inside the mirror. I'm not sure. It's really confusing. Well, how do we get there? This is the word. I have to kill four memories of this monster to open the mirror. Maybe it's best if I don't tell you. I have to kill four people. Well, not really people. Not really people. But I was I was hoping that we'd be able to get into the illness part later. Like, I didn't think we should start with that. I thought that he would mention that something's been off about her. Or she, but he didn't. Like, there was no other opportunity to talk about the illness. I have to kill four memories of this monster to open the mirror. What? Yeah. There Ghosts. Memories. Is anything here real anyway? This is all just a bad dream, and I'm not gonna think twice about it when it comes to saving Ivy. But... you can't. Dream or not, I can't believe you would do such a thing. What? What choice do I have? I can't leave Ivy to die. But you can't just murder somebody. They're not... They don't Unless seem... You already did. They don't seem like people. <laughs> Shit. There. I'm starting to think I was wrong about you. Maybe <sighs> you're not a good guy after all. Killing the first one made the mirror crack already. They're not people! They're hideous, evil beings! They're not people. They're hideous, evil beings. And you really believe Ivy's inside the mirror? Yes. You'll change your mind when you see them. The first one practically begged me to kill her. Yeah. Still not a fan of this venture, I'm afraid. But I'll hold my judgment for now. Okay. Anything else I need to know about? Do we need to blow up an atomic bomb at some point? Are we opening an interdimensional portal for the man-eating beast to plunder the Earth? <laughs> I think I accidentally killed a cat. You've got... Someone else's brain. The hotel manageress likes me a little too much. Uh, let's be completely forthcoming with Agnes. I I like that idea. Honesty is the best policy. I think I accidentally killed a cat. Joe, how do you accidentally kill a cat? It's easy. You put a cat toy in the furnace and wait. Oh shit! I was just trying to catch it. It was the axe man. Oh, never mind. I was just trying to catch it. Joe, be honest with me. I thought we were just. Are you some sort of psycho? Look, the cat had a key, and I needed it. I didn't mean for it to die. I, I don't even know why I brought this up. Oops. No. I should know about these things. Okay. Any more skeletons in the closet? Yeah. Let's let's end with the big one. <laughs> the hotel manageress likes me a little too much. It's totally beyond me how any woman could like a guy like you. There's nothing wrong with me. Do you like her too? No. No, she's crazy. That explains it. Anything else? Yeah, you've got someone else's you've brain. Got someone else's brain. What? Whose brain? I don't know. I don't know. 
some guy. He didn't really need it. But I... I liked my brain. Sorry. It wasn't there. You can have it back if we ever find it. <laughs> well, that's comforting. Oh my god. What else do I need to know? That's no, pretty much all of it. <laughs> pretty much all. Except... Didn't you have something for me? What? Oh Just yeah. Before we got attacked by the axe man. You said you had a message. A note or something? Ah, yes. Completely forgot about it. Here, take it. Second note from Ivy. Okay. Lead the way, dude. Let's go save your wife. She better be worth it. How dare you? How dare you? What if she's not worth it in your eyes? It's a signed invitation to the party, apparently taking place in Function Room A of Quiet Haven Hotel. It's got a Joe Davis plus one written on it. Ha! Ah, so she knew. So she knew. Ah! You fucking jump scare! Blocked. Can we unlock any of these other ones? What about this one? This is manager's office. Manageress's... The manageress seems to be the only staff member here. We're not going back through that door. Alright, let's try to open it. Wow. Oh, didn't she say to meet her in her office? Shit, we shouldn't be here. Holy crap! There is a hanging thing. A noose. A noose. Uh. Huh. That's really weird. What is with these... Very strange depictions on the wall. Let's leave. We don't. I don't like it there. Okie dokie. The shadow of the noose is a person hanging. What? I missed that. Oh my god! You're right. In the shadow, it's the manager hanging. I don't think we need to call her manageress. That's uh Yeah, it does. It does. It does. Do you see that on the wall? That's crazy. Did she hang herself? Are we hang gonna hang her? Door. Not shut. All right. So we got to make our way back to like level 3 or 4 or something like that. And go into the party. Now that we have an invitation. Oh, hey. We have a little bit of green grass. No way. What? Do you know what this is? Yes. It's a house, Joe. No, what Not is it? Not just any house. You smart ass. My wife and me. We used to dream that one day we'd get a place outside the city. We planned every detail. A two-story white house with red flowers at the front. Oh, she red. Always liked red flowers. Red flowers. And I would drive a red Cadillac. My dad had one back in the states. Like that thing over there, by the shed. Wow. Yes. Exactly like this. So this is their dream. Why did we fuck it all up? Wow. So we're getting a glimpse at what the dream they were hoping to have someday. That's sad. With red roses in front. Or not red roses, red flowers. Doesn't matter. Two story. It's a bit big for them. Maybe they wanted to have children. Phone. Even if it was working, I wouldn't know who to call. Kitchen. The heart of so many happy memories that never happened. Aww. When did food become such a problem in our life? Oh, that's right, because she would stop eating. I'm not really hungry. Man, Joe, you should have, uh... You should have sought out some help for your wife a lot sooner. But, I mean, this happened... We don't even know what time frame that this happened in. So, 
eating disorders did not really come to the spotlight until very recently. Like, nobody really cared about it. There was not any awareness. It's full of weed? The jar is full of weed? Why? Hey, what's that? This? That's... Mm. That's just parsley? Cooking herbs. Just a jar full of oregano. I'm not gonna lie. It's weed. Weed? Like, cannabis? Yep. <laughs> There's a lot of it in there. Yep. Oh, and it stinks. Yep. Do you smoke this stuff, Joe? I I guess he does. Since as two people with traumatic past not dealing with their issues, of course they were going to make decisions that look that took them further from their dreams. Yeah. They they were seriously disadvantaged, I think. Castor oil bud was it Oh, it stinks. Okay. Nothing else to do around here. Bin, fridge. The stairs seem to end suddenly, like if there's nothing at all up there. What? How crazy. Oh dear. Oh dear. Hey guys, why do you think... Why do you think that he never told Ivy that they met as children? Like, he said that he never told her. And that's probably for the best, but... I mean, wouldn't wouldn't you think that eventually it would come out? I mean, they got married and everything. Don't you think that they would have it would they would eventually talk about it? Was it was it just literally because they didn't want to bring up the event? That seems I don't know. That just doesn't seem like <gasps> Sophie. This is another Sophie. Is this the last incarnation of Sophie? There's almost nothing human about her. I doubt I'd get a reply. Besides, I don't really want to talk to her. I want to kill her. But how? Well, Agnes? Well, Agnes? Well, Agnes? What? I want some more descriptions. I want... Usually they say something. Holy shit! Oh, 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 oh! She's got cuts all across her shoulder. She's got cuts across her chest and shoulders. And down each arm and then down, like, looks like each breast, maybe. That is some serious, like, body mutilation, or maybe references to, uh, plastic surgery, or, uh, like, weight reduction, uh, li liposuction, maybe? Sicker, Agnes! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at the troll faces on the wall? Right here? I don't see troll faces. Oh, these! Wait, no. That looks like the, uh, the theater things. Um, how the hell? Castor oil! Let's castor oil her to death! Agnes has nothing to freaking say? Seriously? Come on! The drawings seem to concentrate on her. What? You mean the ones above her? I don't see their eyes moving or anything. I think they're just paintings. He said, yeah, they're troll. Hmm. I don't know. I, I have no idea. I can't interact with them. I can't even look, with a look at them. Well, let's check outside again. It's very limited what I can do here. Okay. Why can't I just stop and talk to Agnes and be like, so... What do you think of my story now, huh? What could I possibly do? There was a trash bin in the kitchen. There was a fridge in the kitchen. Wonder if I can actually just go straight back and come back later. We can. Um I don't know I don't know if we have the means to kill that Sophie yet. We'll come back later when I have a better idea of things. There's a piano block in the way. It's blocking access to the lift. Maybe Agnes can help me push it out of the way. 
give me a hand, Agnes. Okay, can I play it? Oh, that's pretty. Hey, I know this one. It's, uh... It's Coldplay, right? <laughs> no. This is the music we've been hearing throughout the game. No. It's not Coldplay. But I'm sure I've heard it before. Keep playing. I've almost got it. Good, Joe. Nah, I haven't played in years. Anyway, that's enough. We don't want to spend all day fooling around. Um, noise she makes and noises she makes in the bed. How strange! What a strange achievement. Can I go any further this way? Is this where I came from? Okay. Aha! All right, boys and girls, you know where we're going now? You're not gonna like it. Wait, were we just on floor... What floor were we just on? Shit, I don't remember. You're not gonna like it. You're not gonna like it. Okay, Agnes, what the hell? What, what are you... Right? Will you just... Is this gas I smell? Yeah. Don't worry. I've got it under control. What do you have to say about this Sophie, huh? One of the four incarnations. Looks half dead already. Alright, let's, uh... Leave? And shut the door? What? Ooh, autosave. What? Why did it show that? I don't know, I'll go back later, but we are actually right here. Open. Yeah! I feel I feel like we're doing things. I feel like we're doing things in the right order, it seems like. What? What? Looks like there's a big party taking place, but where are all the guests? Looks okay. Happy birthday! <gasps> oh, oh, this is another Sophie. Is this one of them? I think so. She looks she starved. What? Did you not see the other ones? She hasn't got one hiding inside. It's hard to say because of the mask, but she seems pretty upset. Go away. Don't. Don't look at me. No. Please. But why? He said... He said I'm fat and ugly. And that I should go and kill myself. Whoever said that's an idiot. People are cruel. Get over it. Um. Whoever said it, he's an idiot. I don't like the get over it part, but. He's always right. Person. I was a fool thinking you can ever fall in love with someone like me. Oh. This is just heartbreaking. Uh, this one does not seem like a monster whatsoever. This one seems almost more humane than the first Sophie that we encountered. Um. Fuck Harrison. You'll find someone better. Yeah, she needs support. She. And love. There will never be anyone like him. 
He's an asshole. Yeah. No. The only thing that comforts me. The only thing that's left. You're gonna eat? What? You're gonna eat? Uh. What will you do? I don't I'll hide somewhere. I don't want to be presumptuous. And I will eat like a pig, like a disgusting, hungry animal. Oh. Stupid fat body explodes and scatters the room. My bloody trails. Jesus. It doesn't have to be this way. It doesn't have to be this way. We're gonna show some compassion here. But I've already made up my mind. Please, leave me alone now. I just want to sit here quietly a little longer before I <laughs> go away. Yeah. Hmm. Let's try to talk to her again. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Please. All right, let's leave her alone for now. There's obviously nothing we can do. Okay, what? Hey, who are you? Who the hell are you? Salmon? I think it belongs to Harrison. Are you Harrison? Take your hands off my jacket, you asshole. Oh, are you, are you Harrison? There's something in one of the pockets. Maybe I should ask Agnes to distract him for a moment. He looks really smug and stinks of booze. How's the party? It's all good. Go ahead, man. Grab a beer. Like I did. No thanks. He looks a bit tipsy because he's swaying back and forth. You look like you've had too many. Don't mind if I do. You look like you've had one too many. Well, it's none of your fucking business, dude. You're right. It's not. Just try not to cause any trouble. Just try not to cause any trouble. Who, me? I'm a lover, not a fighter. But just between me and you and the lovely bride over there, the birthday girl's got the huts for me, man. That girl's ass, that girl's ass is the size of a football stadium. Oh my gosh. I don't think I can do it without getting super wasted. You're a disgusting human being. Just tell her you're not interested. A few more beers and I'm sure it won't matter. Wow! Holy shit, there's some pretty disgusting dialogue options in this game. Like, oh man. Like, so sometimes I actually am surprised by by how, how far they go. You're a disgusting human being. Yeah, man. She is a disgusting human being. Hey, you wouldn't have a, a cigarette, would you? I'm all out, and I'm fucking dying for a smoke. If you give me ten bucks, I can use it. Fuck off. You fuck off. Unless you, unless you buy cigarettes, <laughs> and uh, we could be friends again. Yeah. Uh, hey Agnes, go ahead and distract this fool for me. Agnes, can you keep him busy for a moment? Sure, but why? I want to take a look at his coat. But we can see it quite well from here. Yeah, but not inside the pockets. Hey there, got a moment? You will not believe what happened. I just have to tell someone about it. A key to his room! Sweet! Alright, I want to save this girl. I want to save this girl. Stop talking for just a moment, sweetheart. How about I show you my room? I don't think so. Come on, girl. You know you want to. Fuck, I hate that phrase. It's time to go, honey. Hey, piss off, dude. Leave it, man. She said no. Yeah, that's the way to do it. <laughs> Men, stand up for girls. Leave it, man. She said no. Like, we shouldn't have to pretend that she's with us. Are you deaf or something? No means no. So stop pestering her. Now is that any of your... Fucking business. Uh, she's my friend, we and I'm a decent human being. And I'll show you how, you asshole. Nah, I've had too much to drink to fight you, so just. Yeah, yeah, sin. Sin's 
Sin's got it right. Agnes is a lady, not a tramp. You okay? Yeah, thanks. I shouldn't have asked you to do this. That guy's a douchebag. I thought you were gonna punch him. <laughs> punch him if you want. No, I'm glad you didn't. It's not worth it. But thanks for stepping in, Joe. You're a real gentleman. Of course. Um, let's take a look back in here. What's going on in here now? Do I? Oh, castor oil. No? I thought I could use. I mean, it's oil. I thought I could use it to like slicken the grip, her grip on it. Examine. It's a, no, that's not what I meant to do. The shotgun. Take the shotgun. So the. So we're turning it off now. I thought we just. The gas supply has probably been turned off. What? But I turned it on. Oh, what the hell! Can't talk to this girl, can I? No. Wait, wait, wait. What? What? Oh, looks half dead already. All right, just checking. Might as well. Like she, like Agnes has nothing to say in that room. <laughs> uh, let's go into his bedroom, which I do. Uh, not anxious to see. I'll be honest, not anxious to look at. Well, left the room with the stove running. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did that on purpose because I thought, yeah, the gas turned off when you left the room. Oh, it did? That's how mental abuse works. He's with her because she looks fine, but he can control her by hurting her mentally. Yeah, maybe, but I think something else is going on. Hmm. <laughs> Which one is this? Oh, wait, I can just look at the key, can't I? Oh, this is our room? Yeah, 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 yeah. This was our room. Exit. Two oh seven. Uh that is upstairs. That is where the doctor That is the same level the doctor was on. Second floor. <laughs> Sin Sin says he cannot unsee the the coincidentally placed buttons of the uh Elevator. Elevator buttons. Oops. Forgot. Forgot. I have to actually go. Yes. This is his room? What the hell? There's like... Is that a bed? It looks like just a wooden bed, maybe? Or a wooden bench? And then just a toilet right there? Huh. Look closer. Dresser. Examine book. There's a torn... There's a torn out page sticking out of the book. I'll take it. Maybe we can save that Sophie with this. What about that bottle that's on the little shelf at the top of the screen? There are bars on the windows? Good looking out. Examine drawer. Hmm. Sticky tape and some money. Alright, take them. Because then we're going to go get a cigarette. <gasps> we're going to go get a cigarette. We're going to send that guy into the room after we turn the gas back on. The Sophie room. The, uh, yeah. The, uh, one with the stove. And then he's going to, then, 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 right? The, um, what do you call it? It's the spark or whatever. The, the embers. The embers from the, um, Cigarette is going to ignite the stove. Alright, let's get out of here. But first, let's see what this says. Alright, that's how we're going to deal with that. This is a game lets you explode a smoker. It's becoming a... G-O-T way? Goaty? I don't know what that is. So are you going to commit murder in front of Agnes? Um, I think I'm going to try to convince her that... They aren't people. Lady in a ha hat? Always watching, always smiling. Make her not see the blind bitch. Make her not see. Blind the bitch. Okay. Okay, it's talking about that. Okay, let's get out of here. Exit. It's talking about that painting on the wall that we can look closely at. 
I wonder what we can do to it, though. Game of the year. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I really, really hate... I mean, the, I mean, no offense, I guess, if, if you guys do this, but I really, really hate when people smoke in places they're not supposed to. Like, right next to the, the entry door to a building or something. When they're not supposed to, they're supposed to stand, like, so many feet away or something so that not every single person coming through can smell it. I really hate it. It makes me nauseous, so I think it's very inconsiderate. I think it's extremely inconsiderate because, like, their smoking is having a physical effect on me. It's making me nauseous. Examine. Painting the lady wearing a hat. I feel like her eyes have been following me around this time. We have to blind her somehow. What do we have on? Nope. Castor oil? What the hell is castor oil used for then? I don't know what... Fine. You know what? Oh, shit! Shit! We gotta go back! Damn it! Exit. We gotta go back because we need to get the cigarettes. We gotta get the cigarettes. Crapola. I grew up in the 80s when everyone spoke. It gave me headaches and nausea growing up. Now I gag when I so much as see cigarettes. It gets worse if I have to pick one up or handle a pack of them. Yeah. Alright, let's find where that vending machine is. I laughed pretty hard when this guy was recording himself and a woman smoking behind him and he's coughing loudly and obnoxiously until she leaves. <laughs> where was- where is it? Yeah! Here it is! Here it is! Oh! <gasps> Oh, good. I, d I did take the money. Okay. Use. Eat my money. Bing. Finally. I should get two packs from that. Shake. Fine. Yeah, I should get two packs for that. What the hell? Okay. We've got a lot of stuff in our inventory now. I'm thinking maybe we can use the tape. We could use the tape over the painting's eyes. Yeah, so I... Yeah, I, I really like that too, that uh, most people who smoked back in the day have stopped. I, I'm glad for that. People I've known have stopped. Uh, third floor. Yeah, I think this was the right way to do things, so we're just gonna leave the... Uh, the house, the dream house alone for a while until we have something to use it on. No smoking! Look, it says no smoking. He's gonna smoke right here, isn't he? Rrr, rrr, inconsiderate douchebag. Tape! Use. Right? I don't know what happens if you. What? What? Hidden passage? I love hidden passages. I'll go through every hidden passage. Special things. Okay, I'm ready for a spooky scary thing to happen. Spooky scary. Come in. Okay. Is that the doctor? Oh, she covered her eyes. Oh, poor thing. A bottle of gin, not really my sort of drink. Let's take it anyway. Take everything. Just to have it with you. I have seen this one. Have I seen this one before? No, that's impossible. I may have seen that painting before. Body. Examine. So this is why he never came back. Holy shit, how does that accidentally happen? You have a... What is that called? A buzzsaw, maybe? <laughs> Sin! Sin is the man! He never saw it coming! <laughs> I love you! Uh. Let's go ahead and take this. Aww, that's really cute. Well, not cute, but kind of, I don't know. It's a, it's a it's thing, thing. I feel a thing about her covering her eyes like that. She's sweet, sweet girl. Okay, I don't know why I need a buzzsaw. Okay, we need to do this in the right order, because I don't know if I can die if I do this in the wrong order. No smoking. Cooker, turn knobs. Nothing happened. The gas supply has probably been turned. Oh shit! Are you telling me I have to go back down to the cellar and turn it on again? 
There was a skill skull on the wall? Where? I want to see it. I want to see it. I want to see it. Is it in here? I do not see a skull. Nope. Didn't see a skull. Skull, 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 skull on the wall. Okay, I'm gonna run down to the cellar to try to turn the um, gas back on. Enter. This is a lot of back and forth. I'll I'll be honest. This is a a lot of back and forth. Oh yeah, I totally missed that. Good eye. Right side of the hidden passage room. Huh. Okay, I'll go back and look at it again. I do want to see it. It looks drawn in. Okay. Now we gotta go down the stairs. Into the cellar. Where we animated Agnes. This was where it was, right? believe so. Why does it have this weird little yeah, cutscene right there? What back. the that supposed to mean? fuck? Well, I did take something from him. What? You don't want to know. Can you give it back? No. No. But now he's being a bitch about it. <laughs> but isn't he dead? Somehow it didn't stop him from pulling that lever back. <gasps> and I've got a feeling he'll do it again. Again. So, if you can't give him what he wants, then maybe we can bring him something else instead. Yeah. Let's look around for a replacement. <laughs> Dang. There's a big gaping hole where his brain once was. Oh, shit. I d Agnes is making a much better use of it. I can't return it. But maybe I can find another brain? Maybe. Let's just let's just pull it cuz why not? I switched it on. Okay. Well, just cuz, I mean, he said he said that it's going to get turned off again and again, but I mean, look at his brain. Why not? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I I think I got that much. We got to find it. Oh my goodness. It's kind of like starting to to get more difficult keeping track of all the things I need to do. Uh, we can't kill whatever fa uh, uh, douchebag's fate. Uh, we can't kill douchebag and take his brain because we need the gas on to do that. I don't think we've seen any other brains around. Uh, where do we need to go? Let's give the dude some s no, don't get him the cigarettes yet. Brain, 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 brain. We have a saw now. <gasps> we do have a saw now. Yeah. All right, let's try it. <laughs> Let's try it. I don't know. Am I just gonna like punch him out and then what? Like, what if I actually just try to use the the saw on him? <laughs> I shouldn't cut this. Um, won't we offer him some? I don't know, gin. I don't think getting him even more drunk will help me with anything. But he asked for cigarettes. Maybe I can at least give him that. Okay. Let's do that and see what happens. Oh, I don't want to smoke. Examine. I quit smoking a few years back. We can't even just give them to somebody. Give. Cigarette? Oh, fuck yeah. Hey, man. You can't smoke here. See that sign? Are you for real? Who gives a shit? Look, you'll just trigger off the fire alarms and the sprinklers. Do we really want to get drenched? Well... That would ruin my hair. Yeah, a what a douchebag. Go smoke in the bathroom. Now that's a great idea. Laters. Ugh, see, it's not gonna work. It 
that's not gonna work. Shit. Skull on the right wall. Oh! Are you talking about this one right here? It's kind of like a cartoony skull? The bathroom is where the bodies are. Yes, it is. Yeah, I know the bathroom is where the bodies are, but the gas is not on. I have to. I would have to go in there, turn the knobs on while he's in there, and also the dead body probably turned the gas off already. I don't want to die. He's not in here. What the hell? Yeah, I don't think that was... Shit, let's take a look at our items. We have that with torn page cigarettes gin saw yeah he didn't go in the bathroom he's not there he's back here again okay so we're gonna yeah we we gotta figure this out first before we give him the cigarettes okay so she just says the same thing Poor little Sophie. No, Captain, I, uh, like, I know I didn't turn the knobs on, but the dead body down there, like, Joe already told us that he's probably going to keep switching the main gas supply off again until we give him a brain. <sighs> We're bodies, 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 <gasps> bodies! Bodies. Bodies! This is a body. I shouldn't cut this. Crap! Why can't I take one from one of these bodies? Take the- take a brain, I mean. Am I get- uh, If you take the dead body's arm, he can- can't touch anything anymore. The dead body's arm, he can't touch. Oh, pff. yeah, yeah, if we just go down there with a buzz saw and just take his arm. Crap. Where, 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 where? Okay, so the doctor's face is just fucked. Ground floor. Pig? The pig brain? Can we give him a pig brain from the pig that's in the kitchen? <laughs> Can't you saw the shotgun free? It would really be sawed off. <laughs> oh my god. I hope you guys are appreciating these as much as me. Yeah, let's try this thing with the pig. Let's try this thing with the pig. It's, it's a legit idea. It's solid. I mean, he's dead. I mean, he shouldn't be so picky, right? Examine. I'm gonna have to put a bunch of stuff in there. Cooking pot. Pig. Pig. Oh no! It's not letting me highlight the pig. Shit. Cooking pot. Okay. Other ideas, other ideas. There's one in the freezer? Was there? Was there? We're checking. We're checking the freezer. Was there though? No! Piggy. Don't start feeling sorry. Oh, this pig! Just this pig! Die. Pigs are really intelligent, you know. Their brains are very similar to ours. A pig is a pig. That's all it is. Okay, I can't go in the freezer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry. Agnes? Yeah, you might want to step out. Oh, she covers her eyes! Oh. It looks just like a human brain. And he just picks that one up with no problem. Like he he was like I'm not touching that brain. I'm going to need to like put it on ice. I'm going to need to like have something to carry it with. I ain't carrying that thing in my pockets and he just shoves a bloody dripping pig brain. Okay, let's go. We've got a plan. We're gonna have to take off in a little bit. Right? Like, if that's not a clue, I don't know what is when she says, their brains are very similar to ours. Uh, where is this guy? He's down in the cellar, isn't he? So we better take the stairs. 
Gonna have to take off shortly, guys. These uh, two-hour streams. About as much as I can do in a single day. A little much, maybe. I enjoy doing it, I just I have, have to do other things. Go. Blow the guy up before you take off? Alright, let's see if we can get that done. We'll blow the guy up. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Here you go. There. I brought it back. Jeez. All right. Gas supply. I've switched it off now. What? Okay, um Why was it still on? I, I thought switched it on. Switched it on. Okay. We know exactly what we need to do. We need to go to the bathroom, we need to turn the knobs on, then we need to give a cigarette to the dude. And that will be the end of this stream, the today's stream. We're gonna blow up the dude and we're also gonna end the misery of, have you noticed that we haven't seen any alternatives for killing the Sophie in the bathroom? The one that's barely alive, that we're about to blow up with the stove? I have not seen any alternatives to that one. Like saving her or not killing her. Um, it seems like there might be a way to save this, um, this so the Sophie that's in the party room. I'm gonna try. Hopefully if we kill Harrison, <laughs> she won't wanna... I don't know, she, it might... I don't know. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, the one that we found in the dream house... I mean, he said it looked barely human, but nice. Is this gas I smell? Yes. Don't worry. I've got it under yeah. Control. Yeah. Okay. Is it going to blow all the bodies apart so that we can retrieve the shotgun? It is. It is, isn't it? I'm calling it. I'm calling it. All right, dude. Hey, Harrison, buddy. Hey, you wouldn't have a, a cigarette with you? I just I'm out and I'm fucking dying for a smoke. I just Happen to have a cigarette for you, bro. I got you. You want another one? Yeah, why the fuck not? I know, I know. This lady doesn't like the smoke. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> you ready? You guys ready for this shit? Are you ready? Are you ready? Shit, come on, come on. Let me see it. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, Agnes. Uh, don't get too close now, dear. Close the door. Close the door. Close the door. Hit it. <laughs> Joe. It's true when they say that smoking kills. At least he went out with a bang. Now he's half the man he used to be. <laughs> True when they say that smoking kills. You get to choose our own shut one liner. Up, Joe. Just shut up. Alright, let's go inside. We probably have a free shotgun now. It's gonna look so bad. <gasps> it broke the mirror. Oh damn. Well done. Oh damn, oh damn. I hope you're happy now. Dude. I had to do this. Yeah, yeah. I know. But did I tell you I'm allergic to human intestines splattered all around me? You are. <laughs> Just do what you gotta do and tell me when we're out of here. Okay. And stay close, please. You got it. Alright, where's my shotgun? Oh my god! Aw, <laughs> oh, dude. You alright? No, I'm not alright. What oh. happened? I tripped over some legs. Harrison, always an asshole. Always an asshole. I don't really want to talk about it. <laughs> oh, God. Let's just go. Yeah. She's just blocking out as much of this as she can. Where's the, where's the shotgun? All right, guys. Well, we, uh, we did it. We gave Harrison what he deserved, maybe? I don't know. He was he was a pretty horrible disg head, disgusting human being, Ouch. you know. I told you. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. It depends. It depends. 
It depends on what? It depends on how you feel about oh. severed human heads. Didn't didn't notice that right Not away. That good, to be perfectly honest. Then keep your eyes shut. We're almost done here. A severed head. What do we need with severed head? Anyway, the uh, so the the walls are lined with all of the uh, the insults and put downs that um, the bad voice, the demon voice, was saying, and what uh, the little Sophie in the party room was was saying about herself. It's really sad. But uh, we're going to have to call it here at uh, 1 hour and 56 minutes. Um, I will have this uploaded to YouTube tonight. That way people can um, start watching it and get caught up. I'd rather have a couple of days between streams to give people a chance to get caught up and then join in on, on the next stream. <clears throat> but I had the opportunity to stream both days, so I wanted to take it. Um, the next one, The next one will probably be in a few days. Like maybe, shoot, like maybe Tuesday or Thursday. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one. We made a lot of progress, I think. And thank you for joining me. Yeah, thank you for joining me. Yeah, it just auto saved, so I'm safe. Cool, cool. Have a good night, everyone. Uh, take care, and I hope to see you next time.